Wow. Truer words have never been spoken. Hello everyone and welcome back to another Gaming for Comedy Defiance video. Today I've this is a very special day for me because I finally discovered how to fight against people using cloak. And it was all because of this man with no name that I saw in the forums. This get this guy he's incredible so uh i took the time to actually read over every single perk that's in the in the ego grid and uh i came to the conclusion that the only way to stop cloak without using cloak is to use decoy with uh the sensor sweep perk okay so like the name suggests decoy is a decoy you use it to distract your opponent so uh right now i'm gonna show you kind of what that looks like when your opponent's distracted and uh you know hopefully by the end of this video you'll understand how to properly uh you utilize decoy and sensor sweep in tandem with one another so uh as you can see you send it out and then it runs for like three seconds and then it just kind of stands there so, which allows you to sort of wait around the corner for somebody to come and attack it kind of like that and then you go in there now see the problem with what I did here is that I activated decoy too soon before there were enemies around so this guy I didn't really get to use the sensor sweep aspect okay so probably the main problem with uh, the sensor sweep perk and it's not really a problem it's just a downside is that when decoy is on cooldown it just doesn't do anything so unfortunately you know I was kind of shit out of luck there but don't worry it gets better now uh, this really didn't have anything to do with decoy but uh I just kind of got owned by that guy. You know. Again, long story short, uh, we lost. But uh, that's okay. That's okay. Because I didn't do this just once, you know. I was just getting warmed up in the beginning. You know, so now, stay tuned for round two, where I really start whooping some ass with decoy all right so uh dj why don't you run that back and let's get it popping okay so we're gonna jump right back into the action this time uh that was actually my fault because decoy it was ready but i just didn't use it so uh you know just ignore that now this here this is how you how you use decoy properly you throw it in and then you kind of reveal the three people in front of you that are stealthing and then you're you see like I should have I should be using a grenade launcher obviously because there's so many stealthers why would I use anything else besides the grenade launcher now this again this one was my fault again because decoy was ready and like I just didn't press the button actually that had nothing to do with, with decoy really or did it I don't know you tell me was that decoy was that my fault or did I just... is there no one to blame for that except the guy with the infector I don't know I had a cool thing about decoy is that you can swap places with it and sort of confuse it's supposed to confuse the opponent but uh, it didn't really do that but uh, it was probably because I was standing too close to it but uh, I still feel like he should have been confused there, but he wasn't. But, you know, that's okay. He was probably just really smart or something. Now, uh, th this this doesn't really have anything to do with decoy. That I, I just I just thought that was kind of funny, right? You know, the shotgun just kind of kind of pushes you away. Okay, but seriously, this is how you properly use decoy. See, I ran into an ambush with two people. I called out my decoy, and then I hid. And, like, th this guy is just really smart. So he completely saw through my disguise. <laughs> 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 
Okay, this is where a decoy really excels as an ego power. What you do is you send it outside, and then you switch places with it, right? Then you run back next to it again, and then you hide around the corner, and you wait for somebody to come, and then you take their kill. That Honestly, that's as good as it's going to get with decoy. Like, that scenario that just played out, it doesn't get any better than that with decoy. So, uh, I hope you enjoyed the tutorial. I definitely did not enjoy suffering through making it, but I do it for you. So that you can use decoy and own people just like I did. And hopefully, hopefully when you play, you don't get a negative score. Okay? Thanks for watching, everybody.